Well, hundreds of students in the Fayette County school system competing today in a countywide science fair. And for nearly four decades, the competition has showcased some of the best experiments that students have come up with on their very own. ABC 36's Justin Walker takes us to Frederick Douglass High School. Project was on if sodas are bad for you. Southern Middle School sixth grader Ryan Murphy giving a lesson on his science project. My mom always said that uh, sodas are bad for me because like I, I drink a lot of it and like she says well that's gonna keep you up at night it has a ton of caffeine in it. It's a theory he had to put to the test. We tested four different sodas, uh, including mineral water. Murphy was one of 500 students in grades 4 through 12 from the Fayette County School System, all competing in the 38th annual Kentucky American Water Science Fair. The competition returning to full capacity for the first time since the COVID pandemic. And it's really a way for kids to show how they use science and making sense of the world around them, figuring things out, or just doing general experiments. Each student coming up with a unique question and tests for their experiments. You start with the, the younger kids and the, the projects are like easy to understand. They're kind of cute. There are a lot of great colors. And then as you move to the high school stuff, I'm telling you, I don't know half the words in just the names of these projects. It's so impressive. The final results presented to scientists and judges. Science is so important, you know, in an age where sometimes we dispute facts, you know, and so it's so important to have that basis of um, that's the scientific method and be able to think critically and analytically about things. But there's an ultimate goal. It's fun. You know, to me, a science fair project should be fun. It should be something they're interested in, something that they should do. And it's not necessarily, you know, I'm going to cure cancer today. It could be something that I'm just very interested in. I wonder why. As for Murphy, he might be listening to his mom from now on. So what they're saying is sodas are still bad. <laughs> yes, sodas are still bad. In Lexington, Justin Walker, ABC 36 News.